Catch up and get ahead with the edge for the week of May 23rd. If you saw a whopping increase in your property tax bill, you're not alone. Residential property taxes are going up all over the San Antonio area by nearly 8%. Bear Appraisal District's chief appraiser came out to San Antonio Central Library on May 16th to explain what's up and what you can do about it. Go to nowcastsa.com to replay video of his presentation and of the question and answer session with the audience. That might help you decide what to do about your tax bill. We've also got a link to a handy San Antonio Express news map showing the average residential property value increases in Bear County by zip codes in 2015. The Texas Supreme Court recently ruled that the state's Byzantine system of school finance is just barely constitutional. It said Texas school children deserve transformational top to bottom reforms that amount to more than a Band-Aid on top of a Band-Aid. But the justices said it wasn't their job to tell 181 members of the Texas legislature what to do or how to fix it. So what's next? I talked to the men who filed suits to fix the system, and here's what they had to say. So these pro-equity and anti-equity groups, uh, they need to realize that if we need to build a robust system, especially with this legislature, who is not always kind to opportunity for all, uh, to take any action in the upcoming session, they're going to have to come on the same boat. They're going to have to come together, put aside their differences, quit trying to extend the equity gap between the wealthy and the poor. And if they all come together again, you're not talking about just 600 districts. You're talking about all 1,024 school districts and their 5.5 million school children. Join Nowcast SA for a live webcast on May 26 at 6 p.m. when Dr. Bernard Walschleiger will discuss his book, a German life, against all odds, change is possible. The story describes his struggle growing up in Germany in the shadow of his father, a highly decorated World War II German tank commander and Nazi officer. Dr. Wolschleiger eventually converted to Judaism, emigrated to Israel, and served in the Israeli Defense Forces as a medical officer. Last Friday was UTSA student Jacobo Talamas's last day as a Nowcast SA intern, and we're going to miss him. Could you be our next intern? Listen as JT talks about what's in it for you. Hello, my name is JT, and I have been an intern at Nowcast SA for one year now. Today is my last day working here, so there is now a new intern opening, and I strongly urge you to consider an internship at Nowcast SA because it is not only a place where you can meet a lot of people, but it's also a place where you can learn a lot of things. Um, we deal with a lot of community issues, uh, dealing with the city, and me being able to watch videos, edit videos, write stories about those things actually help me with my school. For more on all of these stories, go to nowcastsa.com. As always, thanks for watching The Edge, and see you next time.